sew this hoodie, I'm going to use a combination of the overlocker and also the straight stitch sewing machine. I know that some of you don't have overlockers at home and that's completely fine. You can use the straight stitch sewing machine for the whole thing um, or you can use zigzag stitch um, on your domestic sewing machines. We're going to start with our pocket, so I'm going to take that over to the overlocker and start sewing. So we're going to sew around our pocket piece. So we're going to sew from the bottom here, up the side, around the curve, across the top of the pocket, and then down the other sides. Don't worry about doing the bottom edge because that's going to go into the waistband. So now that you've overlocked around all of your edges, we're going to head back to the straight stitch sewing machine and sew the next part. Now I'm back at the straight stitch sewing machine and we are going to sew down our curvy edges of our pocket. I have my pocket piece here and I'm currently looking at the right side. So this is the side that is flat. The wrong side is fluffy. So next I'm going to pin my curvy edges um, on each side over one centimetre. But I'm going to pin that from the right side. So now if I turn that over, it looks like that and from the front it looks like that and I'm ready to sew. I'm now going to sew the curvy edges of my pocket but I'm going to sew from the good side, so from the right side and I'm going to do a top stitching line six millimetres from the edge of the fold. So all we need to do to do a top stitching line at six mils is to line up the edge of our fold with the very edge of the foot. We will now mark the placement for our kangaroo pocket. To do this, we need to find the center point of our front. So remember the front is the piece that has the lower neckline. And we also need to find the center point of our pocket. To find the center point of our front piece, all we do is fold it in half. And where that centre point is in the middle of the bottom front, all we do is put a little mark there with our tailor's chalk or marking pen. When we unfold that, we can now see that the centre point is here. To find the centre point of our pocket, all we do is fold it in half. And down the bottom here in the centre, that is our centre point and we put a little mark there. So when we unfold our pocket, we can see that our centre point is here. For our pocket, we're going to measure up 21 centimetres from the mark at the centre front of our hoodie front to 21 up here. And just put a little mark right here. Flip your pocket over to the wrong side and measure 21 from the centre of your pocket up to the top. And put a little mark. Now match this mark with the mark that you have made here. So the pocket will be upside down on the front of your hoodie. So this is the right side and this is the wrong side of the fabric. Make sure that your pocket is straight and then we are going to pin that on. I'm back at the straight stitch sewing machine and I'm going to sew my pocket on 
which is currently upside down, but it is going to flip back to make our tandoori pouch pocket. I'm going to sew it on with a one centimeter seam allowance from here to here. Now that you've sewn your pocket onto your front of your hoodie, we can now flip that pocket down and we can see that the pocket is now ready to sew our sides. And we can also put a top stitching line across the top here if we feel that that is too puffy. I'm now going to fold each side of the pocket um, ready for top stitching. So I'm going to fold it under one centimeter. Instead of top stitching this the same as the curved edge of the pocket, I'm going to edge stitch the sides. I'm now going to finish off the pocket just by top stitching just across the top here. Stitch is about three millimeters in from the edge of the face. So now we have our kangaroo pouch pocket all attached. The last thing we are doing for today's class is joining our front to our back at the shoulders. So you have your front piece, which has your lovely kangaroo pouch pocket attached, and you also have your back piece. So all we need to do is place them on top of each other. Okay, and match up our shoulders. I'm just gonna put a couple of pins in there. And now we're ready to go over to the overlocker and sew those two seams. So we're now back at the overlocker and we're going to sew across each shoulder seam. So this one here and this one here. So great work today everyone. You now have your hoodie with your front and back connected. You have your kangaroo pouch. And so next session, we are ready to cut out our sleeves and put them on. See you next time.